There, there are multiple reasons that go into why an employee would want to work at a company. We're here at Metal Tech. Now they are a huge subcontract machine shop in the Southwest. They have around about 50 machine tools yeah. here. Amazing. Stephen, why have you got so many filter mists attached to your machines? Well, the filter, filter mist system is a, is a fantastic system. It's very simplistic in the way it works. It doesn't require a lot of maintenance. And as you can see on the filter mist system behind us, the green lights, that's actually part of a monitoring system, which would tell us the condition of the filter and how efficient it's actually performing. Now, talking about efficiency, this is a machine shop that you have success, don't you? You know, you ha have so many systems in place to make this, the floor is immaculate, it's clean, you're running it very lean. Yeah. Why is a system like this so important for yourselves? Well, there's a number of reasons, really. Uh, one is just to protect the, the internal workings of the machine, to remove the, the mist uh, that is created by machining process. But more importantly, it's to provide an environment that is healthy and conducive to removing the opportunity for long-term uh, respiratory issues that staff could otherwise suffer from. So we're trying to create uh, as near a perfect working environment for them as we can. You know, you're covering the health and safety side, but also it's quite an attractive place to work if it's clean as well. Uh, yeah, that's all part and parcel of it. There, there are multiple reasons that go into why an employee would want to work at a company. Um, they spend a lot of their, their working life within an environment. They spend more time here than they do at home, potentially in their waking lives. Mm -hmm. So therefore you want to make sure that that environment is as inviting and as stress-free for them as you possibly can. It's good to see you put um, systems like this in place. Now, there's some stickers on some of the machines. Can you explain these to us? Yeah, well, what has to happen with uh, mist extraction is the machines have to, or the extraction units themselves have to undergo an LEV test. Uh, that's a local exhaust ventilation. That takes place every 14 months. The idea of the stickers at the point of test, that is the period of time by which you should be leaving the door closed for the extraction system to ventilate or extract all the mist within the machine. That's gonna take, that's time. You know, we are always talking about saving time on machining, but that's a long time for someone to maybe have to open the door. You know, if it is 10, 15 seconds that they have to wait before going in, that's, you don't want that, do you? You want that to be the least amount as possible. Yeah, you're looking for the assistant to be as efficient and effective as possible. Uh, and in part that is by making sure that the right filtration unit is fitted to the machine um, and also looking at the cutting conditions. Things like on the, uh, we've been talking earlier on about the WT300 we've got. For example, on the side of that machine, we have got an aftermarket, uh, what we call a tramp oil remover. And it's a system that removes residual oil that's created or pumped into the coolant by nature of the slideway oil. Uh, the Nakamura, for example, produces a lot of slideway oil. So we, we remove that, we skim that out of the oil. That is one of the constituent parts that will burn off during machining and cause the misting.